We are at the International Exposition Center in Cleveland, Ohio for the Progressive Motorcycle Show. So let's go on in and see what we got going on. All right, it's January 29th. 2019 and as you see we're inside uh, I got myself my t-shirt of course gotta have a t-shirt but let's go on in and see what's going on well it is official I am here I have my little tote bag for all my little goodies and, yeah there I am about all nine feet tall four inches in diameter yep clearly see that I have lost a lot of weight and grown <laughs> you believe that I got a bridge to sell you yeah, no. uh, it's probably a little bit more like it yep Suzuki's very good Alright, those of you who know me, you know I started out something very much like that. Only something tells me that this thing wouldn't be constantly breaking down. Just a guess. Oh yeah. So you got it. There's a 200. I considered that one too. See the course for the guys that just don't like the smaller bikes. Sure. Well, for those of you who are wondering how much room is up under the uh, Bergman 200, that's it. Yeah. Helmet here. Helmet here. Tool bag here. This is what they laughingly call a tool bag. Sorry, that don't cut it. Yeah, I like it. Ah, they don't got the battery hooked up. Of course not. Well, I don't know if I missed them, but I think Yamaha forgot some of their some of their more interesting bikes. And I think I found an interesting bike here. For those of you who can't afford the whole bike, dang it. Very cool. It's a damn good idea of exactly what's going on. Look at that piston. Look at that piston. This is all you really need. Very cool. Little tank. Very cool. Yeah. I would prefer to buy the whole bike, but I don't know. Maybe some people are different. Ah, very cool. I know you would. Oh, for sixteen hundred. Very cool. 
I like it. I like it a lot. Well, maybe we find something a little better than fucking salmon grill. It takes half 30 hours. Well, we do have some scooters in the classics. Very cool. Very cool. Very cool indeed. I gotta admit, I like this little blue one. It's very cool. I like that. Amberetta. Very cool. I like how the colors work on this one. This is cool. I like that a lot. Very cool. <laughs> Alright, I think it's time. It's time to get out of here. Head back towards exit 34 on the turnpike and head north. Um, oh, they've got root beer floats. Oh. They've got root beer floats. That's so unfair. There's the one that I wanted to see right there. That's the one that I was thinking about. I like it. I like it a lot. Look at that. Oh. This is like style. Check it out. This break. Oh, the pop. Yeah, I like it. Yeah, but drum break in the back. Air filters in the same spot. Everything's basically the same. Now, you know, I come all this way. Might as well. Oh, she's a bit tall. I won't get used to that. There's supposed to be a handle there. I don't care if it's a brake or a clutch, but there's supposed to be something there. <laughs> That's an optimistic spinometer. Very cool. Of course, that's your switch right there. You gotta have the key fob before this thing will do what it's supposed to do. Everything else is basically the same. They did move the horn up like they did on the PCX. And 
turn signals down here instead of being up here. Very cool. Very cool. Oh, there you have it. That's the 2019 Progressive International Motorcycle Show here in Cleveland, Ohio. January 26, 2019. And in case you didn't catch it, Honda's brochures are for 2018. Everybody else's is 2019. Go figure. Anyway, that's all I got. Anyway, Trekker, out. I'm heading home.